Namaste, my dear friends. Today we are in the fifth video of a series of Vini Yoga FAQs on the beautiful topic of Pancha Mahayagya, the five great rituals. And today we come to the last one that is called Brahma Yagya. And this is considered in Vedic times the most important ritual of all. And this is honoring our teachers. No matter how intelligent we are, we all have teachers in our life. It could be our parents who taught us how to walk, how to eat, how to communicate, our first teachers. It could be our school teachers. It could be our spiritual teachers. We all have teachers whether we recognize it or not. Sometimes our education blinds us and makes us very arrogant that we think we are above everybody else and that we don't need any teacher. In India we always say do not kick the ladder that took you to the top because you may need it. And therefore Brahma Yajna becomes a very important ritual, perhaps the most important ritual, which also keeps us more humble. By being humble, meaning by being a student. When we recognize and honor our teachers, we are reminding ourselves that we are still students and we have a lot more to learn because life has so much more to teach. The moment we think we don't have anything to learn, we are finished. So in this way, Brahma Yajna is a way of honoring our teacher on a daily basis. Take some moments at the end of your practice or at the beginning of your practice to honor the teacher who taught you that practice. Honor your teacher who taught you yoga. Honor your teacher who taught you about how to live life. We all have had challenging moments and somebody guided us. Honor those people who guided us in those challenging moments, whoever they are. Because we all need teachers at different times to guide us because we don't necessarily have all the answers. And Brahma Yagya is not just to one person, it is to those people who taught us. So please take that seriously. And you may be a teacher to somebody and therefore they will honor you as well. And that will nourish you. Just like you honoring your teachers will nourish them. In a spiritual way, in an energetic way. And it will also nourish you because you keep your heart open to learning and you keep your head low with humility rather than allow the ego to dominate. So please, my dear friends, I invite you to practice Brahma Yajna every day by just praying for your teachers, remembering your teachers and offering them gratitude or actually spend time with your teachers by learning, by visiting them, spending some time with them. Please take this seriously, my dear friends, and I really hope you will integrate in some way all the five yajnas into your life. Namaste. Namaste friends, I am Kaustubha Desikachar of the Vini Yoga tradition and I am very very glad that you have come this far in the video. If you have come this far, it means you really like and appreciate our videos and let us know how you feel about it through comments below. Let us also know that you appreciate it by giving us a thumbs up and also clicking the notification icon so that we will be inspired to produce more free and valuable content like this and we let the community grow so please 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 subscribe to us so that the algorithms pick our videos in a much better manner and thank you for sharing these videos through 
your social network so that it reaches as many people as possible. This is the best way we can do to share nice content with our close friends and our students and other people who we care about. And be safe and be happy and be healthy as we are going through very difficult times but let us remain connected to our heart with hope and Shraddha. Namaste.